いやべえ YouTube, this your boy PMG back with you with another movie review. So today we about to talk about Prey. That's on Hulu right now. This is gonna be a spoiler review. It just it's so much to talk about. So I'm gonna do a spoiler review. So if you haven't seen it, you should subscribe, add it to uh see add it to your see later. Check it out, then come back and check this out. Okay, so let's get on into it. I really enjoyed this film. I kind of wish it was released in theaters. I think they, I think they actually had maybe a limited release. I'm, I'm not sure exactly, but I follow, um, I follow YouTuber John Campia. Uh, if you're familiar with him, yeah, I follow him, and he actually saw it in theaters. So, um, I definitely want to see it in theaters. And after seeing it, it was, it was, it would have been worth seeing in theaters. Right out the gate, I love um, I love the um, character building, the plot, the story, everything. With to me, it was on point. Yes, you kind of have some of that. You kind of have some of that SJW, just a little bit of it, but it's not so much to where it's like you know you're gonna start rolling your eyes. But um, I really enjoyed this film. They did a great job. And, um, I was just like, wow, man, like I kind of put this one, my favorite, always the first one, the predator. I love my next one would be predator two. And I would put this right behind predator two. And then the last one I put, uh, predators that last, that last predator movie though, trash, but they really kind of went back to basics with this. Uh, I love how they added. Like we actually started seeing the dynamics of the hunting, like you saw, you saw animals hunting and stuff like that. It was the they did a great job. They didn't, they didn't. Um, as far as like some of the new stuff, they didn't do too much. Like you could kind of, the predator was kind of grounded. Yes, he kind of his weapons, his his weapons he had was you could tell they was definitely. Um, not from earth but they still was kind of they were still kind of grounded compared to some of the the weapons we have seen in um the previous films but i just i really enjoyed it like as far as our main character i don't know her name but she she's trying to prove herself that she can hunt and you know she keep getting outshined by her brother and other male um characters that's in the that's in the tribe or whatever and you know we start seeing her progression she slowly progressed and slowly got better over time then there was certain things that they built up and they utilized it at the end of the film which i love like she had an axe she you know she kept trying to hunt with the axe she kept trying to hunt it then she upgraded it by adding a rope to it that way she can utilize it utilize it in different ways and then that axe, her upgrading the axe with the rope actually helped her out in a situation where she fell into, um, it was like some mud, but it was kind of like quicksand. So her having that axe and using that axe to latch on to something to pull her out, that really, the, the writing with that I love. Then um, it was some medicine. It was like, a, I guess it was like a flower that they utilize, um, they utilize a lot, I guess, when it came to cooking and doing different things. One of the things it does is when you, when you take it, it lowers your, your body temperature. And that element ended up being utilized later down the road, which I love. It was just so many different things. Then, um, as far as the predator, his helmet, with as far as his, the way his targeting system was set up, once the predator locks on to a specific target, it you know it keeps shooting at that target. So at the end of the movie, that was utilized. So it was everything was just like building up. It was building up to the main conclusion, and a lot of that stuff was utilized in this one 
one epic uh action scene at the end. Man, it was it was it was crazy. You know what I'm saying? We kind of seen the predator in different different situations too. Like it was a situation he kind of went against a he went against a wolf. Then it was a situation where a snake was about to eat. I think a snake was about to eat uh I think it was a rat. I want to say it was a rat. Rat or a mouse and then the predator ended up killing it. So it you, you saw you saw you saw the predator in different different situations in terms of hunting and stuff like that. And it was it was good, man. I was definitely surprised that I thought it was gonna be like a huh, gonna be a t- it was gonna be a B movie. It was gonna be so so, but they they really did a great job with this movie. Um, what else I can hit on? Uh, trying to see what else I can hit on. Um, they got one scene where the where the predator was just going off like it was just kill after like kill it just to. The execution of it was just like, oh man! Like, it, it, y'all definitely have to check this movie out. Definitely needs to check this movie out. It was good. If you're a big, you're a big Predator fan, definitely check this movie out. Don't play around. Definitely check it out. Um, let me see what else I could add in. Um, I don't really have too many negatives. The only it's it, it's not really. A, to me, it's not really negative. It's more of a Nick pick. Basically, the whole SJW thing, but they only really touched on it just a tab. So it wasn't like it wasn't like overly annoying. Like, let me see. A prime example of it being overly annoying would probably be uh Captain Marvel. But that's really that's really it though. But overall, I really enjoy everything about it. Uh, the end, well, I would say the mid, mid credit scene that I really, that really like boosted it up for me was she end up, she end up learning how to utilize one of the guns, them old fashioned guns back in the day. And that particular, that particular gun was... That particular gun was the same as that gun that the Predator gave Harrigan at the end of Predator 2. And I was like, whoa. I was like, wow, that was crazy. But I think y'all should definitely check it out. Check it out. You know, get you some popcorn, drinks, wine, whatever you're going to do. And definitely check it out. And my rating for it is an 8 out of 10. Get in the comment section. Let me know what y'all think. You know, what was your favorite Predator? How would you, how would you, um, what's your order? You know, you like Predator 1, Predator 3, you know, whatever. But uh, get in the comment section. Let me know. And we can chop it up. But until then, I'm out. Peace. Thanks for watching. Hit the like button. Hit the subscribe button. And stay tuned for new videos.